shock is a condition where there is circulatory impairment leading to a state of impaired oxygen delivery to the tissues. So all of us are familiar with this concept from medical school days. So we have different causes for shock depending on the age group, the situation we deal with and so on. And the approach to the shock depends on what is the underlying cause. Why is the circulatory insufficiency important? So if it is for a short time period, there is a reserve mechanism, the cellular metabolism could be impaired, but this is reversible. However, if it is prolonged, it becomes irreversible shock. It's very important to identify the shock early in the process before the decompensation happens. We have often seen children or uh, babies who deteriorate very rapidly. Whatever we do doesn't work. So they have decompensated. So once they decompensate, you cannot really revert it. We call it a vicious cycle, the acidosis, the cardiac dysfunction, the further hypotension, everything keeps going on and on and we are unable to retrieve the process irrespective of what we do after that stage. And maybe by that time the brain injury has happened as well. So even if you do manage to retrieve, there is uh, irreparable damage to the brain. So it's very critical that we identify early and it's very important to stress here that identification depends on close monitoring. So you re really depend on an expert nursing team who will support the baby and identify problems and indicate to the medical team at the earliest possible so we can act on time.